One doubles team making a big statement this year is the duo of Alexander Peya and Bruno Suarez. After victories in Barcelona and Sao Paulo, the pair have announced themselves as one of the top teams, able to compete with the very best. Only teaming up at the end of 2012, the pair have established themselves quickly. Good old-fashioned hard work is at the heart of their rise. Well, I think the hard work. Uh, we've been practicing a lot, working hard, uh, trying to improve as a tennis players and, and a team. And I think so far we're doing a good job with it. And it all seems to, to pay off in the tournament. I think right from the start when we started playing together, um, we had a good feeling on the court and off the court. And we just developed our game together. I mean, you gotta get to know your, your, your partner better on the court, especially. And, but even off the court, it's very important. As the season reaches halfway, the new duo are in prime position to make their first Barclays ATP World Tour Finals in London. When we came together, it was a, a huge, huge goal for us to go to the Barclays ATP World Tour Finals because um, that's where you want to be. You watch it at the end of the year, you're impressed with the stage. And I've been watching all the matches last year and you see that home and you just get the feeling, I want to be there, I want to be part of it. Playing there, it's our number one goal. And I mean, if you're there, it's because your overall result over the year was very good. So just by being there, you probably achieved uh, uh, almost every, every goal you had for the year. So it would be very special for us. It's, it's going to be our first time, so if you can make it, it's definitely a very special feeling. And with a new ATP World Tour 500 event in Rio next year, Suarez will have the chance to claim a second win in his home country. It's amazing for me being Brazilian to have another tournament, uh, especially in, in Rio. It's uh, our number one touristic city and it's a beautiful city. I've lived there. So it's very nice to have a 500 event in Rio. For me, it's very special, of course, but we're also looking forward with everything that we have coming on, uh, uh, World Cup and Olympics, and now having uh, this big tournament. Rio, it's, they sponsor the tour, and they want to bring people to Brazil. So I think it's another great opportunity for tennis fans. Next week on ATP World Tour Uncovered, presented by Rio, going green. We're at Queens and Halle as the grass court swing begins. And the last German Grand Slam finalist, we catch up with 2003 Australian Open runner-up, Rainer Schuttler. Don't forget to log on to atpworldtour.com for your 24-7 breaking news and talk with us on Facebook and Twitter, now available in English and Spanish.